the hell? I think I've seen that Zombo do that before, like, just go down and then, like, stand straight back up again. It's kind of creepy. Kind of like in an exorcist sort of way. Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days to Die. I'm Ravenhurst. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we are going to go sell a bunch of stuff to the trader and then um, either just do some random POIs or maybe uh, tackle a Tier 4. I'm not going to do any Tier 5s. Uh, at least I'm, it's not my intention, anyways, to do any Tier 5s uh, on the Let's Play series. Those I am saving for live streaming because they take so doggone long to do. Uh, all right, so I've just been busy doing stuff around the house, as usual. Uh, I got the garden harvested and continuing to feed the forges, um, you know, trying to replenish our steel. And uh, right now I'm building the clay back up in these guys. And I went through all of my spare armor and consolidated uh, what I had, repaired uh, what I had for sale. For sale, I also need to do the same thing uh, with my tools and uh, with some of my weapons, but I'll do that um, a a another time because I'm completely out of space in my my box here, and I figured, well, uh, let's just go ahead and stop there. Okay, so everything that you see in here, uh, we're going to sell. Did I just hear a chicken? We need a chicken for our uh, our pen. There's a bunch of Zeeks out here. I heard a chicken somewhere. I have not seen very many chickens around lately, but of course, I haven't really been looking real closely for them either. We need a female chicken to make our coop. Alright, well. I went around and repaired all the spikes and all the concrete around the moat, but they're already getting banged up again. Oh, the other thing... Did I just see the chicken over here? The other thing is that um, uh, I'm starting to get tier 3 zombies now. And they're like really tough to kill. Uh, so yeah, that's fun. <laughs> um, okay, well, I don't know where that chicken went. If, it, if I even heard it at all, I might have just been imagining things. Uh, the other thing I did too is I put a, I put a switch here. Um, so that I don't accidentally drop the drawbridge when I'm over on this side. Uh, that was actually suggested uh, to me by a viewer, a friend of mine actually, uh, Wyoming Joe, uh, on the stream the other day. So that was a great idea, and we have done that. All right, anyway, this is what we're going to sell everything here. I don't know if you guys know this or not, but you can't repair nail guns, and even if you could, it doesn't matter because they all sell for 270 no matter what condition they're in. So... Yeah, there you go. Um, so we got some pretty high ticket items in here, uh, like these, for example, fifteen hundred uh, for the for those guys, fifteen hundred for those guys. Um, that one's just a four sixty, sixteen ninety eight. So yeah, we're we're gonna. Uh, I've got a whole bunch of extra hazmat stuff too, of course. So we're selling that as well. Okay, so let's do this. Let's go ahead and pull everything out of there except we're going to put the coin back in um i'm going to take one sugar butts with me and then we can keep those in there too and then what we'll do is uh just load up the bike and uh, head over to the trader and then like i said we will take a uh either a tier four quest for them or i might even say screw the questing and just go randomly hit some pois that i haven't seen yet uh, I mean, it's still worth doing the questing because we have a chance of getting a really nice reward. Oh, I have a, an abundance of extra headlamps. Those A stack of those sells for over 3,000, so pretty nice. Uh, silver does not is not used for anything in Ravenhurst. See, there's no recipe option, so we just sell that. Okay, let's head on over to the trader. the hell? Oh, there's the chicken. Okay, so I guess we just butcher it, right, to see if we get a, a female chicken? Nope, we didn't. I mean, I don't, I don't think there's any other way that I can interact with it other than 
butchering it, so. Alright. Well, we'll keep trying. I'll go put this back and meet you guys at the trader. All right, we made uh, almost oh, you want to forty-three thousand huh? off well, a wreck. Maybe you should try Shamway. <laughs> we got tier four. We've what done C high. We don't care about that. Uh, this is back. Lakeside Lodge. We've already done that. <laughs> this guy's terrible. Church. We've already done that. Okay. So yeah, we're not going to do any jobs that we've already done. Uh, let's run over to Trader Jen, sell these remaining pieces while our uh, Sugar Butts are still active, and then we'll see if she has anything unique that we haven't done yet. If not, we're just going to randomly hit some POIs. Here, let's actually stop at this trader, Joel, to see what he's got. Okay, let's see. He's got... Hostile, which we've done. He's got Hostile, which we've done. Asylum, which we've done. Asylum, which we've done. I think I might problem? have hit that one twice. Well, there's always tomorrow. I could really use and that. the high school, which we've done. Well, I can't say okay. I'm not disappointed. Um, let's like sell him this stuff here. Pleasure, Go away. Whoops. Okay, let's get over to Jen. We have five minutes left, and I have a couple more engines to sell her. Alright, let's see what she has for jobs. Supplies. There's a zombie Colony ship already done it. The Duke is blocking all shipments until that job is done. We always need someone to handle the tough jobs. Okay, this is new. This is a tier four clear, it's industry something or other. So let's take this job, because I've haven't done that. Oh, I would kiss you, but um, you know, okay. apocalypse hygiene and all. Nice, okay. Let's check the vending machine here. Um, yeah, we'll take a sugar butts. Don't care about the rest of that. Okay, cool. So we found a new tier four that I have not done yet. Um, and it's to the north, so let's go check it out. Okay, so it's this place here. All right. And this is a clear. I am not familiar with this POI, so let's just get started with it right off the bat. I, you know what I should have done? Darn it. I should have looted those cars first, though, and salvaged them, but I didn't, so whatever. Let's take a look and see what they got inside. Oh, very nice. Dang. Oh, by the way, I um, I had four points accumulated, and I spent those points on... I went ahead and just got fortitude maxed out so that way i don't have to screw around with those glasses because you know half the time i forget to put them back on anyway uh and then put uh so that took three points and then i put the last point in um oh i guess i didn't put the last point in healing factor so we need to do one more point for healing factor as well um what did i put it in i don't remember now i put it in something uh but anyway oh i know what i put it in i put it in um uh, over here in agility. Yeah, I put it in agility. I meant to actually put it in here, but we'll we'll hit this next, and then we, we'll focus on agility after that. Okay, so let's check these vehicles here. Uh, I don't want any of that stuff. Uh, I can come back and wrench these later. I'm not going to wrench them right now. Your 
radiated Zikaroos. Um, oh, you jumped over his shoulder. Look at you. Where are you guys all coming from? Must be another way for them to get around, I guess. So we've got two Zeeks here. Let's let them out. Edgar, quit. This is juking so much, man. Damn. Should have brought some extra shotgun shells. Alright, we got an irradiated spider in there. Looked like he was running around here. Stick your head through. Oh shit, there's two. Okay. That could mean a broken leg for us, so. Son of a bitch. Ah, shit. Get the hell out of here, spider. Oh. That's rather intense. Okay, let's uh, go in here and... Let's see. We're going to take one of these for the infection. And now we got a screamer. Lovely. Let's get this load reloaded. I don't know where that screamer is. Let's take this for the abrasion. I don't want that screamer to see me. Okay, everything's reloaded. Sure, where she's at. Oh, is she in a, a room back there? She must have got through there from the back way, I guess. Yeah, she's there. I think we're good. Whew, man. All right. As usual, we're not going to loot anything significant uh, or anything except for significant items like medical piles, bookshelves, and rattlesnakes. You stuck in the thing, huh? Let's scrap both of those things. 
check the medical. Okay, let's go this way. There's a munitions crate over there and a couple things here we can look at. Um, yeah, it's worth hanging on to and selling, I suppose. Take that stuff. It's right here. We might as well look and see what's in there. Okay. I think that's pretty much it for here. Let's look for uh, mineral water in here. I don't believe you can make tarps, so definitely want to keep those. We need them for the rain barrel, and they're also used for a couple other things, too. I don't think I'm going to take either one of those things. At least not right now. Get everybody out of this room? Up here, so. All right, let's check the munitions box. Okay, let's check this uh, army truck and see what else is over in this uh, little garage area. Some beef. Alright, that just comes back outside there. This is probably just cabinets and stoves and other shit like that, but yeah, I'm not going to look at look at all of that. Okay, let's go around this way. Okay, there's a Crawler. There's a zombie over there coming towards us. There's a toilet in there. He just jumped right out the top. goes outside. Oh, look at that. Okay, we got two runners. Passing gas box and something else in the corner. Ooh, look at that. Ammo bag. Okay. I'm just wearing my luckies all the time now. I probably won't use my nerdies unless I'm doing like Horde Knight. Golf cart chassis. I think we already have one of those. Okay, come on. Give us something good. Yeah, that's overall pretty good loot. Okay, I guess that's it for down this hallway. Just gonna look in here and see if there's anything. Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay.
All right, so we have looted everything in here. Uh, on this floor here, we'll check this. There might be a schematic in there. Or ink. That's always good, too. Come here, lady. This was the front. Oh, we missed this bookcase. And is there another way to go over here? Shit. Yeah, there's like a parking area, I guess. Okay, so there's a basement going down that way. Uh, we'll take those. I'm not going to take that, that other stuff. Uh, I need to pull this wolf over here because I can't go over there. Oh, he's out of range. Damn it. Okay. Hit him in the ass. There we go. Come over here, bruh. Ow. Let's see what's in here. Machine gun parts schematic. Uh, okay. Guess that means we can make the parts themselves, eh? So that goes up to... Let's go back over here and drop a couple things off. And let's head on back in. Okay, so I think let's go up and then later on we'll go down. What's this? Insert a hundred chips to spin. Like, as in Dukes? Hmm, let's try that. Do we have to right click on it? Doesn't do anything. Huh. Maybe... Maybe we actually have to find poker chips somewhere. Uh, I don't remember ever seeing poker chips in Ravenhurst. So I'm not sure what the deal is with that. Okay, anyway, yeah, let's uh, let's go up first and then we'll go down later. And we get some new red dots. It's in here. Okay, we'll scrap that. And we got some shotgun shots. Alright, only C3 Zeeks. One of them is a football player. Okay, we got rid of him. The other guys, I think, are in a back room trying to break out. Yeah. Can't quite get a good enough shot on him here. There we go. Skill at shotguns has increased. What is our shotgun skill now? Let's take a look. Uh, shotgun weapons, 33. Okay, cool. We're working on it slowly but surely. Just bathrooms, it looks like. Okay. Oh, this is like a pool. Oh, this is cool. Look at this. 
How nifty. I thought this was supposed to be like an industrial place or something. It's more like a, an, a health club or something. Well, at least <laughs> I don't know what it's more like. All right. So we got Zeke's in here. Any chance at all we could pull one at a time? It doesn't usually work very well in Ravenhurst, but let's just try it. Okay, yeah, we got him. Okay, there's a Nurse Nancy over there. Is she a runner? I think so. She seems to be moving pretty fast. Okay. Don't see any zombies over there. There's something right there. I think that's a lab zombo. She's just a walker. Don't see a whole lot of walkers anymore. Can they not? They must not be able to get around that corner or something. Okay, we got a crawl. Oh, shit. What was that? It's a bird. Dirty rat. Oh, shit. Did not even see him. Okay, we got a Marlene coming in. Okay, let's kill this crawler. He did. All right, are there any more birds in here? Not that I can tell. All right, let's go this way. These are the showers. This is cool, man. Somebody did a really good job on this POI. Okay, there's the lifeguards. Wow, look how deep this pool is. There's a, a crate at the bottom of it, too. Working step. Oh, shit. Not yet. We'll go after it in a minute, but not right this second. Because I want to make sure the place is clear first. There's a bird. Oh. Come on, guys. And we got dogs, too. Okay. Let's get back in here so we have a, a choke point. Nice of them dogs to get caught on the locker door for us. Appreciate that, Fido. And okay, we got one, another Zeke somewhere. He's swimming down in the water. All right, let's go back around this way again. So a bunch of them were hiding down behind there. My guess is there were some hiding behind here that we got out too. All right, we got a, a white, or no, that's a feral soldier. Okay. There's a fallen soldier. All right, let's get back here a little ways. Is there anything up here? Just a chair. Okay. Beautiful.
And stay down. How come zombies can swim faster than we can? That's not, that's bullshit. <laughs> Look how fast he's moving through the water. He's going to come up around there and come back after us. <laughs> Tough mofos. Well, that's weird. Huh. Seed pack. All right, there's a lot of stuff going on in here in the trees in the way, so I can't see really well. We've got this guy. Okay. Who knows what else is in here, though, so let's just be ready. Three more hazmatters? Okay. Ammo pile here. Okay, take that. Check this guy for a mineral water. Dollar dollar bills. All right, we'll check the sinks for ammo. Don't really need coffee, but since it's already made, I'll take it. Seeks in there. I think I think we've cleared this the outside part of this room though. So I have to figure out okay, so they are trying to come out of here. We've got a biker in the bathroom. So let's let him break his way out. Any day now. Two bikers in the bathroom. Alright, I see another red dot. Oh, it's just you. Okay. There's a bathroom there. This just goes down, yeah, to this area. Okay, so I think we've cleared this floor. And I guess... That's it for up above. So now it's time for us to go down in the basement. But let's get this crate first. Seems really deep, doesn't it? Here, let's go around over here. It's closer to this side. Oh, nice. Wow. That was a really good find. Is there anything in these drains? Doesn't appear to be. This is really cool. I love this POA. I don't know why there's a block of water over there. That's kind of weird. Okay. 
So looks like we're done with the upper floor. Now it's time to go in the basement. What could possibly go wrong in the basement, right? What could possibly go wrong? We'll just go out here and drop a few things off. Okay, he just popped in. There's an Edgar over there. And he just aggroed. Some some bad guys. Aggroed some bad guys. That guy didn't even wake up. What do you know? He still hasn't woken up. All right. He woke up for a moment. Gumball machine. Okay, see more red dots. Okay. Um let's check. Let's check this. Nope, don't want any of that stuff. Check these for schematics. And paper's good too. Got a crawler. So this goes back outside where we were earlier. Okay. Snakes and dogs. What kind of swimming pool is this? All right, I'm assuming there's nothing down that way. Oh, look at that. Okay. That's coming up next, I guess. Check for gasoline. Okay, let's just run down here, make sure we didn't miss something. We'll check in this, I guess. Uh, I'll take that. And that alone... I guess we'll take the cowboy hat mod. How much is that worth? 47. Hmm. If we need to make space. That'll be the first thing to go. Is there anything up above here? Any hidden stuff? I don't think so. Okay, well, I guess we got to break some of this stuff out of the way to get in here, huh? Not that that's hard to do. Down we go further. <laughs> oh man, that was sneaky. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. 
I was not expecting that, obviously. Uh, okay, let's put that one there. Are those... Yeah, no, I don't trust any of this shit. Okay, so this door is locked. Um, wow, that's going to take a million years to break. I was assuming it was unlocked. Oh, shit, okay. You know what we could do? Got a little gasoline, huh? Why not? So that's what's going on, huh? Too bad I didn't have any breaching slugs with me. Okay, um... And we're gonna have to... Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, come on, get me, guys. Exciting. Would have thought that would have been the end of it, but it sure looks kind of like the end room with all these crates and stuff. All right. Well, let's uh, let's let's loot first, and then we'll see what's going on here. We obviously missed somebody somewhere. Got it in the first shot. Okay, come on, give us some good game. Ah, uh, Winchester. That's kind of cool. Doesn't do very much damage, though. Uh, oh, no, that's a shotgun. Okay. And then just some other stuff. Okay, so how does this compare to this? Looks like they're the same... Except for the Winchester has less magazine. Yeah, there's only four. I wonder if we could put the shotgun tube on that, though. This has more rounds per minute, more durability. So, yeah, this is a better weapon all the way around. Okay, so we found the fat loots, but we still have, we still have another enemy to kill so we got to figure out where that enemy is it could be like a buzzard maybe up, up on the roof or something i like this poi though this is cool all right we've got a creepy crawly down there Return to Trader. All right. That was fun. That was fun, man. I enjoyed this POI. It was really cool. Okay. Well, let's go return to the Trader and see what kind of reward we get. What you got, Tra Trader Jean? Amazing. I hope you like your reward. Steel pickaxe, military vest, 7 7, and 13 52. Yeah, this is definitely the most valuable thing, so we'll grab that from her. All right. Why are you asking me if I have special jobs? I've already done opening trade routes. Oh, this is the best way to get dukes and rewards. 
You know what though? This actually could show us a new traitor, I think. Oh, this is a dangerous one. Try not to um get radiated. All right, guys. Well, that was fun. Um, I think the next thing I want to do is check out that train station that we saw a couple episodes ago. And uh, I don't, I don't know if there's a quest for that or what the deal is, but. If that, um, if that uh, opening trade route, see, it's 2.2 kilometers away, so that's going to unlock another trader force. So let's actually, you know what? Let's go, let's go do that right now. Let's go over there and see who this is. All right, cool. So we got another trader and another desert town. Interesting. Wonder if uh, there's probably a road maybe that connects this one with this one. All right. Here comes the Yahoos. seen that zombo do that before like just go down and then like stand straight back up again it's kind of creepy kind of like in an exorcist sort of way all right buddy here you go friend what i could have sworn i've already do, done this but it's okay at least we found another trader so all right let's take a look at your inventory you got a green tack rifle but super expensive Okay, that's all he's got for secret stash. And that's all he's got for normal stuff. Okay. Uh, I don't think I have anything to sell him right now. Uh, but let's look at his jobs. Okay, so he's got four tier fours. I have a task for you, friend. Already done the asylum. All mine. You take care now. Can you help me with my problem? I've already done the hostel. Okay, maybe next time. Safe travels, friend. Friend, I'm also in again. No need to apologize. I'll check my other sources. I've got just the and lodge. Well, All right. Always well, tomorrow. I'll tell you what I think I'm gonna do is wrecked in my town as a a church tier four, uh, which is really easy. I'm well. I shouldn't say really easy, but probably the fastest. Actually, the waterworks is probably the fastest one to do. Um, so I might go just do that off camera, but show you guys the end loot. You know, because you know you've already seen me do it, and I'm sure you've probably done it yourself, and/or seen a lot of other people do it too, because it's just a vanilla boi. Uh, so I might do the church, or if I can find another waterworks quest, just um, you know, mostly just for the opportunity to get some good loot from the rewards how big is this place anyway all right yeah let's go down here and then we'll head north hopefully we'll find a main highway and uh figure out you know what the next thing is um i'm not gonna today is monday monday evening on uh, november 1st and i'm not planning on doing any live streaming until friday so that means that um That means I won't be doing, you know, any tier fives until then, basically. Unless I change my mind about that, but I don't know. I don't want to put out like a, a like a five part episode just to get through a tier five, you know. So anyway, I'll figure that out, and I'm not sure exactly what we'll do in the next episode. Uh, actually, yeah, well, uh, we have two more days, so day 140 is going to be the next horde night. So there's that too, but. I'm pretty much ready. I gotta just do a little bit of touch up on some steel, um, and then uh, pretty much ready to go on that. So I'm not really too worried about the the horde night.
And I've got enough uh, explosives made and everything to... Ooh, look, crack a book. All right, that could be interesting to do. So anyways, guys, I think that's it. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, but I'll try it again. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.